K2 The Hands to show you what to do. What you're looking at is a ceramic tile floor that's missing grout at the base of the wall and the floor. I'm going to show you how to replace the grout by just using a sponge. Normally you could use a float, a grout float, but since this is a small job we're just going to use a sponge to uh, reinsert the grout. You can use a grout removal tool to get rid of the excess grout, but since this bathroom is getting remodeled in the future, I'll leave it there. We're going to use non-sanded grout since our grout lines are less than an eighth. If they're over an eighth, you want to use sanded grout. The grout I'm using comes in a powdered form, so what I've done already, I've mixed it up with water to a paste-like consistency. You don't want to mix it too loose. What you want to do is just take your sponge I'm using a sponge again, normally you would use a, a grout float and just press it into the joint. And then what you're going to do is keep a clean bucket of water and constantly rinse your sponge out and then wipe it out. After it dries a little bit longer, uh, maybe about an hour, um, you're going to come back and wipe it again and make sure you don't have any haze. You don't want the grout to dry on your tiles. so. You're going to wipe it all out and make sure you keep it, uh, keep your floor nice and clean from the uh, grout haze. But remember to constantly rinse out your sponge to keep a clean sponge. And just keep wiping and cleaning off the excess uh, grout that you had on the floor. Once it dries overnight, you're going to come back after it dries and you're going to put a sealer down in that joint line that you just uh, grouted. And that's it. That's all you have to do. Very simple. As always, thanks for watching and please subscribe.